Hi, I don't do this too often, but it seems to be the best way to get the word out. The political primaries are happening right now, and the Democrats are throwing a wrench into the spokes. When you go and research your choice, and please vote, definitely vote, part of your process is to check out when that Republican became a Republican because the Democrats know they have no hope of winning. So in key races, lifelong Democrats are switching parties so that they appear as a Republican on the ballot. And then when you and I and everybody else that's like-minded goes into the voting booth and clicks all the R's, you are secretly voting for the socialist radical leftists. Isn't that fucking tricky? Oh, and I promise not to cuss in this, but God. The Democratic Party was hijacked by the communists so long ago. And I'm about to rant, so if you've got the message to check your voting info about people who are changing parties just for this election, you've got the message. And you could probably go do that right now and please vote. Those of us who want to stay and watch, I'm about to rant. I dedicated my life in the military to eradicate the communist threat. And while I was busy doing that, they came in and took the Democratic Party. Just look at California if you want to see how the left wants the entire country to um, be. Uh, just last night there was a video where some uh, leftist congresswoman was grilling this guy about, uh, what was it? Oh yeah, drilling oil. <sighs> we have to drill because the government taxes the gas too much and five dollars or more per gallon is still coming in the near future. Anwar has finally been opened up and we can drill but the left is still barring that because their ultimate goal is to nationalize the oil company and nationalize the oil industry along with everything else. So let's count them. Nationalize healthcare, nationalize the oil industry. What else do you want to nationalize? Hmm. Leave your idea in the comments while I vamp on that idea. Let's see. I mean, once they've got the healthcare and the oil, <clears throat> we just lost the uh, ability to vote for any kind of government because they will own us. And isn't that the point? We're too stupid to decide for ourselves. We're too stupid to choose freely who we want to represent us in this representative republic. Let me say that again. Representative republic. We don't live in a democracy because a democracy is chaos. If we lived in a democracy and, say, didn't have the electoral college, all national elections will be decided by the people in New York and California, and you're done. If you live anywhere on the West Coast, by the time you wake up to vote, the leftists will have already picked one for you, and your vote will truly not count. So let's be smart during this primary. Make sure that you're voting for the conservative Republican. Hell, vote the Libertarian Party. Vote your conscience. Vote for the most conservative, Trump-supporting person on the ballot. But make goddamn sure you're not electing a rhino, because the rhinos are coming, and it's a huge herd. Okay, rant's over. Enjoy your life, and uh, 
like this video and uh, subscribe to my channel and blah, 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 share, share, share. But seriously, and if you really like this, um, become my uh, Patreon at luckypuppy.net. Thank you.